What does alcohol do to the brain either immediately and then over time? Part of the reason that alcohol makes us feel good is of because of the effects that it has on the brain. So a lot of us hear about dopamine and the benefits of dopamine. Dopamine is increased from drinking alcohol, but it is one of many neurotransmitters that are influenced by when we take a drink. And I think what's really interesting as it relates to the brain is more around GABA and glutamate. These are two other neurotransmitters that don't get as much attention in today's day and age. But GABA is our body's relaxing neurotransmitter. Mm -hmm. It's the one that when we feel an increase in GABA, we get that like, ah. And that is one of the neurotransmitters that is temporarily elevated when we take a drink. So that feeling that we get when we kind of, yeah, the shoulders drop, we feel that relief, that is uh, in, uh, because of GABA's increase in the brain. And it also slows down glutamate, which is one of the brain's stimulating neurotransmitters. It's almost like the gas pedal. Mm -hmm. And so essentially alcohol allows us to take our foot off the gas and press on the brake. And the good news about understanding the physiology of this is that we can use things like GABA as a supplement or L-theanine, which is the precursor to GABA. And we can generate some of these same feelings and uh, sensations by using more natural tools. And so L-theanine is something I use a lot in folks who have that kind of stress-driven or anxiety-driven trigger to drink. But again, as I mentioned over the long term, we're going to have changes to brain structure, we will have changes to how we produce those neurotransmitters on a day-to-day -day basis. So over time, we start to burn out our ability to produce this GABA or to produce dopamine. And we then rely on things like alcohol or food mm -hmm. or other substances to kind of give us that feeling or that sensation. But um, as complex and sciencey as it is, the good news is that we can do a lot with food and supplementation to support those pathways. And I really think make it easier to quit or to cut back.